Good morning, Black Squad. I have a really quick video for you today, and since it is quick, I'm actually curious to see how many of you guys will stay to the very end. So, I will be looking at the analytics, and if you do stay to the very end of the video, make sure you let me know in the comment section below. But, we have reached our goal. We have reached 150 souls. We are halfway to 200k mortal plan. Yes, we are halfway to it. We will complete it, guys. I can smell it. I can feel it. It's going to happen next year. It's coming, guys. It's coming. And I cannot thank each and every one of you enough. You guys have made and transformed my life into something amazing. Thank you guys so much. And we hit another milestone yesterday. My first video ever that has ever gotten to a million views on this channel is the review for Dragon Ball Deliverance Episode 2. It just reached over a million views last night. I want to thank Notorious Luke who created Dragon Ball Deliverance along with Merrick Marimo. Thank you guys so much. I am so excited because these are two huge milestones and they happened this week. So I couldn't be more happy and the video is still trending so it's, it's awesome guys. But as always, thank you guys so much, and if you are new to this channel, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications, that way you never miss a video. And these are today's end of video squad winners. If you want to participate in this, make sure to watch till the end of this video, and then drop a comment with the hashtag end of video squad for a chance to be featured in my next video. So I skipped the last episode of Dragon Ball Heroes because um, I saw the previews of it and I saw what was going on and I didn't like what was going on. So I decided, you know what, it's time to put Dragon Ball Heroes on the back burner. But everybody was blowing my DMs telling me that this week is going to be different. This week we're going to get Gogeta and we did get Gogeta but, you know... It was very anticlimactic. Not only is the animation style for Gogeta not as good as Dragon Ball Super Broly, it is really, really lackluster because of the fact that we're fighting a villain like Hearts who has the ugliest transformation that I've ever seen in a Dragon Ball villain. Although his abilities are really, really cool, he just looks bad. I don't understand how, how anybody likes his character. I mean, I thought he was kind of cool when he was well animated and, you know, we were going to see more of his backstory, but we didn't get any of his backstory. And now he's transformed into like a Super Saiyan, basically, with like, you know, horns coming out of his back like Omega Shenron. And he's got the balls like Naruto. And so, I don't know. It just seems like he's a hodgepodge of a bunch of different transformations. And the episode, all he did was basically tank through the rest of the Z fighters, and then Gogeta comes to save the day. Gogeta doesn't even fight. It was a very lackluster episode, and I was very disappointed. But we are getting a lot of hype buildup for Super Saiyan God Trunks. We got a preview, we got pictures, and what I have to say about this is, why are we giving so much hype? to a character that has a lower transformation than the transformations that we know. Super Saiyan God is weaker than Super Saiyan Blue, it's weaker than Ultra Instinct, and it's weaker than most fusions, and yet they're really pushing the fact that Trunks has a different transformation. Now the only other thing that I can think of, the reason why he's got this lower transformation and that they're hyping this up is because this is not the Trunks or any Trunks that we know. The reason that I say this is because of his outfit. This is a different, completely different outfit. And at first, I didn't like the way it looked, but it kind of grew on me a little bit because I do like different Trunks designs and we can't always have the OG Trunks looking as sleek as always. So, I think that this is a completely different Trunks that has a completely different God Mode that surpasses all other God Modes. And I honestly like that. Personally for me, I think that they should have only had Super Saiyan God and Dragon Ball Super. I don't like Super Saiyan Blue. I do like Ultra Instinct, but let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of Super Saiyan God Trunks. If you made it to this short point of the video, then you are part of the end of video squad. Like I said earlier, make sure you just drop a comment, hashtag end of video. 
and I will look at the comments and pick a winner for my next video. I want to respond to Goku Dragon Ball Z. I got really emotional when Goku died. I did too, I'm not gonna lie. It got me right in the feels, and I definitely really like Dragon Ball X manga. It's really good. Thank you so much for your comment. This is going to be Blackscape signing off. Take care, guys. Subscribe for more content.